hey guys thanks and welcome to my youtube channel i'm super excited as usual to share this video with you and in this video i want to continue from my last tutorial in my last tutorial i showed exactly how you can clone different variation uh different breakpoint of a website online and then clone them into figma designs i also showed exactly how you can have a responsive variation of them using a free plugin as you can see with this and in this tutorial i want to show you exactly how you can convert this design into a wordpress website so for us to be able to do that we'll be using the help of a plugin if you come down to plugins here we can uh, search for a plugin called figma to wordpress i already have this plugin here but in your case if you don't have it you can just come to manage plugin and then you can search for figma to wordpress so if you do that you should have this plugin here i can just open this plugin in your own case you can run it you can open it as the case would be so right now it will launch up this uh plugin here called figma to wordpress by yotaco it's a fantastic plugin so this plugin will help you just clone these pages into wordpress so right now i need to input your email here and just hit the start now button and the next thing you would do right now is for you to share your figma url this is our figma url here but it's just easy for us to hit the share button here and then hit the copy button and then we have this copy to click button and we can close this and i can just figma url here and then i can hit create your website and then it's bringing us to this next step here where we need to select a frame so now we have uh, uh, five frames here so i can just copy five of this frame here and then i can just add this so you can see we have uh, all of the different frames here added to our main page so this is just a one page website so you can go ahead and add another page here then add all the frames that you have designed for those page uh, so that's literally up to you so but once this is done here i can just hit the continue button uh, so this is yutaku ai going through your pages and checking all the element and trying to see what best wordpress will fit that element usually if it is not a tutorial whether or not i've seen a significant difference between using it and not using it is not the case i would love to still use it either way so you can experiment with both yourself to see if you have a difference but in for the case of this tutorial here i would just say maybe some other time uh, so i still see that i still have a wordpress element here header footer uh, post blog and form and this is enough for me i'll hit the continue button so it's still saying that there are there are still some missing wordpress element uh so blah 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 and that's okay so let's continue without selecting and then you can see it, it is just the main uh the home page and that's fantastic so you can see i have different variation of views highlighted for this and i can just hit the continue button and now yutako is building this frame into wordpress how cool is this so let's give this some time let's see what yutako can come up with as a wordpress thing for us all right so after waiting some few minutes this is done and we can see yutoka says that our website is ready so what we have to do is to eat this review button and here it will bring us here to choose a plan but for the purpose of this tutorial we are sticking with the free i'll come back here eventually i will come and talk about some of their plan uh their design studio and their hosted plan so that uh you get acquainted with how they work so let's start for free and then here apparently we would need a domain that would host our wordpress website for us to be able to see it so right now i can see here that tutorial onewordpressutaku is available so i can register this as a subdomain for us to use for free uh, but in your, own, in your own example in case you want to host your website with them or you don't have a domain yet you can also purchase a domain from them you can type in your domain name and search and then you'll see the pricing and you can pay but for the purpose of this example we are sticking with free so i will add this to cart so you can say i have a zero dollars to pay i'll hit the continue button 
so you can see here because i'm logged in like i logged into my account i have an account with them so you can see i've paid the zero dollars and that's okay i'll hit the okay button and you can see tutorial one is publishing so this will take some few seconds as well for it to finish up all right that's it so we have this done so we can click this and then we would have our website here and then if we come to this url here we're on a free plan if we come to this url here this should open up our website for us so you can see loading your website and you can see here i have wordpress.com website cloned into another website which is my website tutorial one wordpress.utaku.com isn't this amazing so you can see exactly the same thing that you see on wordpress.com and the amazing thing right now is that this website will be responsive even if i check it on the mobile view or i check it on a tab or whatever device i'm trying to use this is fantastic before i end this tutorial let's come down here and let's open up our wordpress dashboard so you can see this is authenticating your wordpress dashboard so that you can see what it looks like at the back end of this website that's it uh wordpress website fully loaded so let's come to pages of this website and let's see how the pages we have so you see we have just uh one frame but two version of it so this is the front page we can just edit this all right so let's close this so you can see here that everything here is clickable so welcome to the world's most popular website builder i can change this to welcome to the world's most uh let me just change this to clone tutorial right that's it so you can see super simple super easy everything here including the images everything here literally is what you can make changes to and that's super beautiful and that's one thing i like about this you can just go ahead change text change images uh customize this to whatever you love uh, to do uh, so that's it uh, so i would not be making changes to this let's go back to the back end of this website if you want to have this website live on your own domain on your own server what would you do and uh, that's the right question to ask right now uh, so if you come to themes here you will see that utaku is the theme that is powering this website if you come to plugin to as well you will see that the only plugin here is utaku that is activated so this plugin is what is powering the entire website so they've been able to put some limitations to what you can do and cannot do with the free version uh, so as it is right now if you want to continue free you have to keep using this wordpress website on this subdomain so right now like i told you earlier for example if you come back to dashboard and then we come to your free plan let's click this so that we can come back to plan so you can see here that this is basically what we have on the free plan storage of one gigabyte basic seo uh do bsd plugin figma bandwidth uh, free ssl world class hosting but from seven dollars per month you can then uh free domain for one year you can use your custom domain you can remove the utaku hearts from the plugin the theme and all those things you can have more storage so you can use them to host the website so once you use them to host the website you have your website with them literally for free and that's what it means uh, but in your own case if you have your own hosting and you don't want to use them and hosting they have another package which i love which is called the design studio and then if you come down here so you can see that you can download this theme uh, if it's just a single theme uh, you can download it for 29 dollars just one time download download the theme uh, then install it on whatever hosting and domain you have that's literally up to you uh, then you can if you are uh, if you want to be using their platform uh, you're a freelancer you want to use this to design website for your client and all those things you can then now start repaying for maybe 39 dollars per month to have three download three themes per month 
or you can go for unlimited and you can start paying 499 per year so i believe this is self-explanatory that's up to you guys you can go check out utaco you can use their platform if you have any issues using utaco i don't work for utaco i'm not even affiliated with utaco so you can send them an email you can ask me if i have answers i would ask i would answer but if i don't you can just directly ask them you can send them an email they have their emails everywhere on their website on their social media platforms you can send them an email and they are quite very very responsive they will respond to you in no time so that's it thank you for watching this video and if you find this video very useful endeavor to subscribe to this YouTube channel so that you don't miss out on further tutorials from me and that's my time for this video i would see another one until then stay safe have a nice time